Thank you very much for watching this presentation. I'd like to first take this opportunity to thank the OCP organization for coming out with the great idea of virtual summit. In this global COVID-19 pandemic, the virtual summit set an excellent example of keeping everybody safe while continuing to move on stimulating the innovation in the open infrastructure technologies. We will eventually conquer the virus. And when that day comes, our best effort of keeping the innovation momentum will certainly get us an even better world. First of all, let me introduce myself. My name is Stephen Huang. I'm the executive director of sales enablement at WeWin. Our company is here to present our solutions open from cloud to edge. Before we move on to our products and solutions, I'm sure most of you are aware of the up upcoming era of 5G. Our industry is quickly expanding from centralized data centers to central offices and to edge at radio access networks. The availability of edge computing offers many applications, which were previously unavailable, for example, real-time artificial intelligence. Edge computing can also offer a dramatically improved user experiences through cases like virtual reality games by decreasing its latency. I'm not going into more details on every one of those exciting applications. However, those cases show that our infrastructure need to adapt and evolve according to the demand of those applications. So here we are. Our company WeWin offers complete infrastructure hardware from cloud to edge. In the centralized data centers, we continue to invest in technologies and building blocks, which enable any scale of customers to grow their infrastructure in a cost-effective way. In the data center offering, we continue to evolve our OCP solutions. Our main solutions, including the Tioga Pass, Olympus, and the Yosemite servers. I'll get into more details about those solutions later. In the central office offerings, there are needs for different situations, like power density or available space for hardware. We have the EP100, ES200, and SV302 for central office and the edge applications. You might notice that there is an overlap between central office and the edge solutions we're offering. That is because we're seeing some of the central office requirements applies to the edge applications as well. By offering the same hardware solutions for central office and the edge, it simplifies the product skew and reduces the caps and ops expenses. Let's go back to the cloud solutions for data centers. As usual, we're a huge supporter for open compute for cloud. I would like to bring attention to some of the 21-inch cloud solutions we have. The SV7220, also known as Tioga Pass, is the 2U3 node solutions for front-end, memory-intensive applications. Olympus, the 1U1 node platform for multiple purpose, less memory-intensive applications. And the Yosemite, the 4U16 node platform suitable for high-density or AI inference applications. As some of you already know, all of those OCP cloud offerings we have are very well known for market proven with some of the mega scale cloud customers. For the central office and the edge, we have the SV302 solution, which is flexible for one new chassis with either one or two nodes. We are also displaying the well known open edge solutions the 3U5 node EP100 and the EP120 solution. The EP100 is with Intel platform. We're also displaying the ES200, which is the 2U1 node central office and the edge solution. All those three platforms are with shortened depth design, which makes them suitable for deployed in the central offices or for edge to be installed underneath tight and small cell towers. Here, I would like to deep dive into the open edge solution we have, EP100 and the EP120. The EP100 SLED is with Intel platform, while EP120 is with Ampere ARM platform. 
The EP100 expedites the open source ecosystem, including Acrino, ORAN, and the OpenBMC. One of the coolest features for our EP100 is that it is designed with flexible node concept. The EP100 is 3U5 node form factor, and in those five nodes, you may use some of the space for non-server devices. For example, you may use the EP100 with four server slats and the one network slat. This allows the whole unit to be on its own, standalone system for Edge. We at WeWin are also developing the 2U slab, which will further enable EP100 with more GPU and the AI applications. Here, I would like to present you a video introduction for our EP100. In other words, I got to take a short break for the duration of the video. Here we go. To learn more, visit wewin.com. Okay, now you can't say that our EP100 isn't cool after seeing that. And we have more cool things to show. We're willing to proudly show you a real 5G demonstration using the EP100 with 5G NSA settings. The demo is our solution partnered with our sister company, WNC, with their switches, 5G RU, and the antennas. To give a briefing for our demonstration, we'll be using the EP100 with five nodes. The first node will be running the multi access Edge Cloud which runs the video streaming engine. The second node will be the EPC for re receiving control commands through LTE. The third node is the 5G RAN CU and the DU. The fourth node is the 5G NSA LTE CU and the DU. Now, some of you may ask, what about the fifth node? In regards to that, we plan to leave it alone. Why? because that fifth node will be net, the network slat. Therefore, you don't need an extra network switch. Going through the LTE and the 5G RU, we'll be showing the video streaming with a 5G phone. This will be our demo. We have many more interesting stuff and we're very excited to share with you. Besides my general presentation of our open from cloud to edge, we also have the core boot Linux boot feature development for server presented by my colleague Johnny and the Jonathan from Facebook. The DCSEM based spec and design details presented by my colleague Book and Priya from Microsoft. Enrich Open Edge for 5G solutions presented by Gregory and Cheer from WNC. OAI SEM buildings on DCSEM to support OAI presented by Hope and CMOC from Microsoft. And standalone rec level liquid cooling presented by my colleague, Albert, and the in from Facebook. I hope all of those presentations are interesting and informative for you. Here is our digital booth, 
you will be able to find quick links to our OCP and the 5G products and the solutions. In addition, we put the video library for our technical workshops as well as the newsroom. We also love to show you who we are, our design capabilities, our global footprints for manufacturing. We have so many exciting things to share with you and we're looking forward to meet with you virtually in our digital booth. Thank you very much. We win. Your best choice for workload optimization and TCO.